Welcome back to another episode of Life Changers, and this is Mike. Thank you very much for tuning in, and just want to tell you how much we appreciate you and everything you do and all the hard work you do. So on that note, <laughs> I want you to know what your self, self-worth is. Don't sell yourself short. We all do it. You just got to know your self-worth and stand by it. And, it, and even in business, right, you got to know your business worth. And your service and that you're providing is what it's worth. Everybody's going to try to shoot you down, lowball you. There's going to be people that are going to undercut you, but know what you're worth. <laughs> so with one of my, I guess, um, trade names that I'm working with and our, what we do is we do we have a lot of handling fees. So we, we charge handling fees. And every time, especially when we were younger, somebody would call and complain about, oh, it's so expensive with all these handling fees and going on and on. Like, we don't hide nothing. We tell you, like, straight up, these are handling fees. This is what you're paying for. And that's all there is to it. And use our service if you want to. And anyways, then right away we'd be like, oh, yeah, hey, we'll give you a discount. We'll give you a discount. And then, you know, started catching on. <laughs> so a lot of people were calling. They're like, hey. Uh, if you just call this company and be like, hey, just uh, call about my, oh, yeah, here's a discount. <laughs> okay, I guess that's smart to do, right? But then after a while, I'm just like, you know what? No, I know what we're worth. I know with, we don't even really have competitors in this space per se, but other transport companies charge way more than we charge. I think they charge a stupid amount because they've been running that whole area for the longest time. Nobody wants to move products or ship things up there far, far away in the land of the cold. <laughs> but you just got to know what you're worth and just stand by it. I'm telling you, you are worth everything. No matter what you're doing, remember, in the end, it's all about what you believe, the energy you're attracting. And what you're putting out in the universe. So if you put out that, hey, you know, I'm an amazing magician. I'm not as good as these other people, but uh, you could afford me, guys. Okay? Just $100, and I'll do a quick half an hour show for you at your son's birthday party. And that's the energy you're putting out there. Well, those are the people you're going to attract. That's like, hey, yeah, yeah, here, whatever. Here's 100 bucks, do. But don't sell yourself short. Like I mentioned in other episodes, my brother studied magic for most of his life, and he still studies it. But he's too scared and puts himself down to actually put himself out there. I know it's hard. Trust me. Me making these podcasts and these videos took me four to five years, like I mentioned in other episodes. But four to five years I had this given to me. Like, it's as if my higher self or the universe is like, hey, here you go. This is where your next journey's taking you. And I was like, oh, cool. And one of my friends, I started, like, <laughs> talking to him, right, telling him things. And like, hey, this is what I can teach you about business, about, um, you know, uh, manifesting and law of attraction. And I started, you know, using him as a guinea pig to prove my concept to myself. So I build enough confidence to go out there and do it. And he's just like, I don't understand how you do all this stuff, but it's amazing. He says, you just talk about it, act, and it's reality. Like, the way you talk and the way you're perceiving the things you want is already real to you, and then it just becomes real. And I'm like, yeah, <laughs> life changers. And I mentioned before, I had this logo already designed, the logo you see right now in front of you, already designed and done. I got paid. I use Fiverr. <laughs> it's a way amazing website. No, they're not our sponsors. If you want to sponsor us, you can give me a call or message me below and <laughs> we, we'll take sponsors. But uh, yeah. And then it was just done. I had the logo, I had everything, and I just couldn't do it. I just kept on going, oh, no, there's other people doing it. And I started watching other people. And I'm like, wow, they're amazing at what they do. Like, I'm not as good as they are. Like, I'm not going to do it. And just keep on putting myself down. But I know people need to hear this. I know I'm going to reach people that need it. 
And if you're listening to this and you got it this far in my rambling, <laughs> well, you're one of those people. I hope that this just touches you to the core and it just motivates you. That's all I want to do is help people motivate and get them to be successful in anything they want. And know that you're worth it. Put yourself out there. Like when I when I hit a thousand <laughs> on TikTok, a thousand uh, followers. We're in the five hundreds as I record this. But when I hit a thousand, I'm gonna start doing lives, and I'm really scared to do it. I don't want to put myself out there, but I'm gonna do it. And just trust the universe. Like this is what I've been manifesting my whole life. And I'm just going to do it because the universe is hooking me up. But I'm not doing my part. You got to remember, you are worth it. You are amazing. You have talents that people need to see. Yeah, there might be a lot of people on TikTok or a lot of people on YouTube that do manifestation things or that do uh, talking about law of attraction and all the things I'm talking about. And it reaches a lot of people. But people need to hear the way I present it, I guess. I don't know. I'm not sitting here patting myself on the back. I'm just sitting here putting myself out there. And I feel that it's going to connect with the people that we need to connect with. On a vibrational level, right? Like we're all connected. We're all energy. And the energy that I'm putting out there is going to resonate stronger with other people. Not everybody, but certain people. And those are the ones I'm reaching out to. And those are the ones I want to click, follow, subscribe. Right? If you're listening to us on Spotify or any of those podcast services, just hit the button. You won't regret it. It's only going to get better. <laughs> if you think this material is not as good in quality as other people, hey, I'm not going to only get better. <laughs> I can't get worse. <laughs> Wait till I do my lives. <laughs> if you want some entertainment, you know, I always, you know, when I was younger, I tried, um, you know, doing stand up comedy. I actually performed at the Yuck Yuck Theater in Toronto one time many moons ago, like over 20 years ago, just for fun. And when I was confident, right? When I was, oh, the world's my oyster, right? And I was just going around performing. And uh, I even got picked up by uh, a company who hired me to do a few shows for them at different events they were at. Like, just come out and do some comedy. Mm -hmm. I was like, you know, 17, 16 to 18 years old when I was doing that. And I thought I was going to be, I wanted to be a comedian. But it's, and I'm, I was good at it. <laughs> Maybe I make you laugh when join my, when you listen to these podcasts or these videos, because I'm good. I guess I like telling stories. I like making things fun, interactive, funny, haha. -ha. Because for me, it just brings good vibes. And that's what I, my self-worth is, is I know that people need to hear what I need to say. And if you're one of those people that don't need to hear what I say, cool. Move on. Scroll up. <laughs> Move to the next episode. I don't know. Go somewhere else. But there's a lot of people that just need to know that you are worth it. I make it a thing that I try to tell my wife. I not as often as I should. <laughs> now that I'm thinking about it, <laughs> now I'm gonna start being better at it. Hey, life changers! I'm changing my life too. But and tell her how much she's worth to me and how important she is. Until I tell my kids that right now, that they're awesome, that they're important. And yeah, we joke like if we didn't have kids, how much more money we would have would we travel in the world, right? But nah, this is where I'm at. These are the decisions I made. And this is my reality. And you got to live in the moment. Live now. Who cares about yesterday? Who cares if you did a presentation at work or at school or somewhere and you fell flat on your face yesterday? Today is a today. Today is a new day. Today is amazing because today is the day you change your life. That's what today brings. Who cares about tomorrow? Who cares about 10 years from now? 
you know, I sit there. <laughs> people will ask me all the time in business. People are like, hey, what's your, uh, your five-year plan or your business plan? I'm like, you know what? I don't waste my time dreaming about where things are. And I don't waste my time. Yeah, we have meetings. We talk about it and where we want to be and all that. But I'm not going to waste people's time, money, <laughs> writing all this stuff down. Because for me, in my reality, I don't need to. We talk about it. And when the next meeting comes around, everything that we thought we were wanting to do. Because <laughs> I just literally roll to punches. I roll. I just go with life. I surrender. I know nothing. But I know my higher self knows everything. Or the universe is guiding me. Do you know how important water is? That if you don't have water, <laughs> I know for me, if I don't drink water, I get a headache, I feel nauseous, I feel sick. I could go without food. But without water, I'm nothing. Look around you. Look at the people in your life. And just know that without you, they would have have had a lot less amazing experiences in their life. Look at your significant other one. Significant other one. <laughs> I'm going nuts here. But look at your significant other. I know that together, you guys change each other's lives. So remember that you are worth it. You are important. You are amazing. You are talented. And know what you're worth. And go for it. Know the market, though, for business. <laughs> Don't be like, I'm worth a million dollars an hour. <laughs> but you have no experience <laughs> in that industry. But you'll get there where you're worth a million dollars an hour. I totally forgot what we were talking about. <laughs> I think we're going to wrap it up. I don't know. Have we? Yeah, let me know in the comments below if we've done one called self-worth yet because we don't know here <laughs> in the studio. We don't know what's going on. We're just making material. You know what's funny? <laughs> we come up with these titles of what I think I wanted to talk about. But what needs to be said is totally different. <laughs> and then I try to bring it back to self-worth. And then you get all that mumble jumble. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, yeah, i got to tie everything back. Uh, self-worth, uh, worth, uh, worth, uh, mm, uh. <laughs> I just got to trust the flow and just go with the flow of the universe. Because, hey, it was really good there until I try to bring it back and take control. You know, I got to give up control and just trust and do it. And that's what we have to do in life is just trust the flow of life. Trust what's going to happen. Trust the universe. Trust your higher self. Trust your gut. And that everything will be all right. Thank you very much for listening and putting up with me. This is Mike. This is Life Changers. And we're changing lives one day at a time.